shower combination. What's the difference between the two? You can't have uh, people taking showers outside. So the outside shower is only for wow. before and after food. Right, yeah, I'm, I go to the other YMCA. Yeah, and they you know, allow that. And also you're, you're drawing a very, a gray line. Like how, do you, how does one? So it's, a, it's not to like shower and bathe outside, it's to rinse off. So if you're gonna jump in the pool, in or out, people, we recommend people to rinse off before they enter the pool. So that's what that shower is for. Yeah, you have to, you're supposed to, you're supposed to do that. So that's, that's the, the one thing, okay? So I just wanna give you a heads up. All oh, right. Um, there's a problem, though, because of the situation everyone's dealing with right now. Um, so a lot of the poor people are in a bad situation. So you're saying you can rinse off, but you can't wash yourself. You can rinse off if you're using the pool. So there's a sign now that says that, that outdoor shower is for people using the pool. So you can use it. You can use that outside shower to rinse off before and after the pool. That's what that shower is It's not for people to bathe in the yeah, But what is the purpose of that restriction, though? It's it, The purpose of that restriction is because our showers are closed. Right? And we can't have all, and we can't have many people taking showers and baths outside because that's not what that shower is intended. And it's very, then we have to go in there, we have to clean it, all that other good stuff. So, but you don't have to clean it after the other people use it. No, if people are using this to rinse, that is a whole renting off to enter the pool and to exit the pool. It's not for regular members to come in and take a shower and So. Yeah, well, uh, the other YMCA location had uh, weren't being like this, and Sorry. I'm sure you can see how that would be inconvenient for someone. You're going to work up a sweat and you can't Yeah, so right now, clean our, up. again, our showers yeah, are closed. So outside is not a, uh, a shower where you can bathe it's to rinse off. So unfortunately, if there's a other Y that's allowing you, I mean, hey, that's that's on them. But here at Newport, that's not what that shower is for. Okay, well, can I get the manager's number or whatever? Yeah, uh, I'm the executive director. So You're the executive yeah, director? My name's Joe. My name's Joe Jimenez. Okay, because so, I'm, I'm going to have to try to pursue this. That's okay. just an unreasonable restriction and thing we're all dealing with this crisis this national tragedy yeah. but to do something like that to to specifically target poor people we're not targeting any poor people it's close to all members the except the other one it's close to me but not the other members uh, it's close in, for all members to shower outside to bathe with soap and all that stuff it's that's why that's why the lockers are closed we're not targeting a specific group we're targeting all our members, where our showers are closed. Okay. And what was your name? So that's why. So if you're mm. allowing... Now, how long is that going to last anyway? Isn't there an upcoming... Um, like in the next and week, aren't we backing off restrictions in this county? Yeah, but right now we're just trying to make sure we're doing everything we can to keep everybody safe as much as possible. Okay. So, so yeah. preventing poor people from practicing any form of hygiene, that's going to help. I'm saying poor people. I don't know your situation. Uh, so you're telling me you're poor. I, I didn't assume that. I'm just saying you can't shower. So mm. I didn't say anything about poor people or okay. homeless or anything. Uh, I'm saying the shower okay, being used, Charles, you can't use that to bathe. You, so you can use off. that to rinse off. Okay, and right, I'll say that. And that and also thing. lets me know that the woman giving me a hard time out there, she told me it wasn't me, but I saw her giving me a dirty look and you know causing a problem. That I was right, you know, just yeah. for my own, so. for my own research. There, like, yeah. Um, so you're and you're not going to change that with the upcoming re relaxation of. Not right now. We're gonna keep our policies right now until, as an association, we change that policy. But if as you an association, so of all the Orange County YMCA's. Absolutely, yeah. So the other, again, the, the other one, they don't count, I don't know. Everybody's shower should be closed. Now, if you're taking showers- It's the bathing, outdoor shower sim similar to yours, so except they have hot water. You, you don't have hot water. Again, because that's not intended for a shower or a baby. It's only two rinse off. No, I didn't complain. I won't really complain about that. I'll make yeah. them do. So, yeah. so if you're using other YMCA showers outside, we can make sure that every branch is consistent. I don't know what's happening over there. I don't know what, why you're talking about either. So, um, Yeah, consistency. I, 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 I think that that's not a good policy. It doesn't affect anything. It doesn't help anything. And it really does impact the community in a negative way. Yeah.
So right now, all our members are experiencing the same, same thing. They can't shower even when they come work out. So the same policy and procedures apply to you, apply to everybody else, apply to even staff. When we're giving instruction to swim lessons, we can't go in there and shower. So that's the same policy for everybody. It's not just only you, okay? So you can, you're more than welcome to use the facility, but we can't bathe outside with lathering up and soak and all that. You can use it to rinse off if you're using the pool before and after, okay? Yeah, there's no one over you I can try to go up the chain or complain about. I mean, honestly, the, I, I, I run this branch. So, I mean, I'm not trying to, I'm just informing and communicating to you the policies. Yeah, that's, I just find it horribly disrespectful. Yeah. It's, no, that doesn't accomplish anything. And I really, you don't even know. I'm, I'm considering buying an office in this area. So that, that was going to be a major component. Yeah. Yeah. So I just fucking came from that meeting. I wasted my day. Uh, well, more than well, that. Like I said, it, it could it could all change it, when things get back to normal. Our office could open. Our showers can. Open. You just said a minute ago that when they change like this again this upcoming week, they are going to relax so, since you're not going to participate in that relaxation. So right now, we can only allow thirty people in here. Okay, that's the policy right now. So that's the guideline: ten percent of your capacity. Okay. So, as guidelines continue to get lifted, it goes up to 25% to 50%. So, if we get 10 people in that locker room, there's no way we can monitor that because of the situation of people taking showers and all this other stuff. So, we have to wait till we get closer to normal situation before we open the thing. I cannot tell you when that's going to be. Wait, so I'm go that, uh, again, the, the scheduled relaxation of the restrictions, they're supposed to be this week. We're entering a new phase, I believe it's called. I don't know if it's this week or next week. I'm not too sure. We just, uh, this, next, not, not, yeah, yeah, you're right. We're mid the third. It's next week. It's, yeah. yeah, but so, this within that, about again, a week Again, that's going to go, if things go as planned, it goes up to 25%. Again, we're still... And you're not going to open the showers at that point. We can tell you all our guidelines are right there. This is the different phases that we're supposed to be in. Oh, you have yeah. it written. So phase three is not even, it doesn't even have a date because we don't know when that normal season is coming. So. But the next one is going to be phase three. I don't know if it's going to be phase three or not. Right now there's. What, what phase are we changed. in now? I can't even tell you because things change. So right now we're in, we're in step five. Okay? Step That's five. That's where we're at. Everything below it is phase three. Be right here. There's no Okay, this says the restrooms are open though. The restrooms are open. The toilets and sinks are, but not the showers. And, and there's no, it's not even on the chart. That's not on the chart anywhere. I get, we're in the highest one here, so. If you look down in the blue, it says phase three beyond, where it says there's no timetable or date for that. On the very bottom, it says locker room, showers, etc. Yes. Okay? There's no, so, there's not even a, but that's yeah. gonna be phase three and beyond. Yeah, so that's the current situation now. If you are looking, hey, I don't, want, I don't want to talk about that. Sorry. If you're looking for someone to shower, you do have to do so. You can try to call. Let's see. Let's see. Now, I'll tell you, I'll tell you that's your case. But that's this is really a You don't understand how bad of a thing this is. Just the last nine level. You can put water in your body. You can't. Like that's not. It's it's basically that the shower. Okay, well, I've got swimming trucks. What if I go jump in the pool, too? I know how to swim. Hey, Actually, have, I'm a good swimmer. If you have a reservation, you want to Oh, wait, you have to have a reservation to use the pool. Absolutely. So I couldn't just you take a five-minute dip when I'm done with my work. It's not how it used to be. Before the moment, yeah. a lot of things have changed. If you have a reservation, we're going to make capacity, so this is changing. I am sorry. Okay? Yeah, let's just see. I've got that woman... I hate it when people give you that mean look and lie to your face. I'm like, clearly saw her giving me a mean look. I walk over to her and ask her what's going on. And she lies to my face and says, nothing to do with you. I'm asking about someone else. Okay, I guess, you know, whatever. But now I knew better. I knew if someone gives you a dirty look like that, like you filth and gets on the radio to call someone, then like, oh, the dude's using the shower to shower. Like, oh, wow. And was it was there, audio is a walk on Wait, I haven't checked in yet. How did you figure out this number? Recognize. No, this is very nice. It's every contender's adult. It gets sent to my email. So it's 
Now I'm sort of planning for the future. This, if I don't have this as a resource that drastically changes the reason, there's many offices I can rent. I was getting the one next to you guys because I'm a member of this club, and that was going to be a site. Yeah, you know, we don't know. It's planning. And I have to a commitment of a 12 month lease. All right. Oh, boy. Wow, that's Thing to think of it, you should never know. This is this region, I assume, this area? Yeah, it's here, it's local. So, yeah, so that, could, that could actually affect me, that could end up helping. Um, yeah, the crowd, like I was, I was just came from the meeting, I was excited and pumped up. There's some spots I can sleep near here. I've got, yeah, I got the money to rent the office. I was going to get my little business going. It was all coming together. That is still coming together. Like I said, this is all coming together. That's temporary, but I'm using the money from the stimulus to try to get my business going. Because I'm a little fool. I mean, I, if I take this little money and blow it on a room and then get screwed, then I lose that on my front place. Poor, I, I'm not a good poor. The, the thing is, work on your business. Get yeah, plan for the future. Yeah. That's what I was trying to do. Or it's a nine-minute bike ride from here to the office, and I've got an e-bike, which cuts it down like four minutes. That that was really, and the trail back here, I found places to sleep and stuff. So I was really, that was going to come together real nice for me. Seven twenty a month to win an office. Are you gonna work out? Yeah, tonight I don't fucking matter. I, I I get to go back to a to a place. I got. So tonight is good. Do the checking down there Oh, you yeah. 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 so good. Okay. Hey, sorry for the bad news, man. Oh, I really just... You don't understand. When people clean themselves, that reduces contamination risk. And the whole facility, the higher hygiene standards we maintain, the less likely... That's why we wear masks. Just in case we're sick, we don't spread it. So I try to maintain the hygiene at a high level. Yeah, I know. Even though I'm poor. But it's not even about your situation. It's not. It's about everything. We're not allowing guest passes. We're only allowing them. So we're trying to do. Oh yeah, you usually have a guest pass program for essentially for poor people to help to the charity. Yeah. But it's not just guest passes for anybody too. So there's a lot. We're not letting outside members. Members from San Diego come to you. We're just not. Well, that one I didn't know. The the reciprocation program. Yeah. So we're not allowing. I haven't even traveled outside of Orange County for a long time. So there's a lot of things that are changing. But it's all temporary, so please get back to me, okay? Yeah. All right. It's going to be next month before I rent out to this uh, toilet, the lease in the uh, but it's only three weeks from now. Like I said, if you need a rent out today, I'll let you. I appreciate the cinema on that, dude. And most most days, that would be important. This day, I already paid for a place. That's why I don't have to shoot my panel. All I do is from the laptop and come to the meeting. I showed up all. Yeah, I didn't bring my saddlebags.
Danke.